Today, a woman who hit and killed a 12 year old boy as he walked home from school will be sentenced. Kelly Parementer, he, she hit him and kept on driving. She had been drinking and using cocaine. She was convicted last month on DUI manslaughter charges. On your sides, Lana Harris live this morning with a look ahead at the sentencing. Lana, good morning. Good morning and along with the fact that Permenter had been drinking and had cocaine in her system when she hit the sixth grade boy, investigators say she was also speeding, that she had just hit another car uh, when she drove into 12 year old Hunter Cope and um, that she made no attempts to break or avoid hitting him when she did hit him. So this is her mugshot for you um, today in sentencing. All of this is going to be evaluated in determining how much time Permenter will get behind bars. She's facing a maximum of 15 years. She's found guilty of second degree DUI manslaughter, DUI causing damage and leaving the scene of an accident. This happened back in 2017 at the intersection of Wonderwood Drive and A1A in Atlantic Beach as Hunter Cope was walking home from Mayport Middle School. Now when Hunter was hit. The medical examiner says he suffered multiple internal and external injuries, but that it was the damage to his head and his neck that caused Hunter's death. The court records show that Preminter has had multiple driving infractions over the years, and unfortunately, this one resulted in the death of a boy just walking home from school. And coming up in the next half hour, we are going to talk more about that hit and run that she had right before she hit Hunter. Here outside of the courthouse, I'm Lana Harris, First Coast News on your side.